Hi, my name is Matei. Welcome to my Discography One um, bundle. Um, here you will find 20 plus one projects inside. These are from my first years when I started to make music. Um, this is from 195. I will just quickly show you what's inside, what kind of music you will find. You must know that these are my first projects that I started composing and making music. You know, I didn't know how to play. I I was at that time I only what I know I was to play drums. Um, this Zero project, this is my first band when we started in 1993 when I was I think 15 years old and we continue for 7 years we did one or two CDs and we played um, we were all skaters and snowboarders so we played punk rock so this is the music you will find here song like two and three minutes long and they're almost all day <laughs> we we're all fans of Bad Religion at that time and no effects and so the music is <laughs> very popular at that time so we played almost every every week we played some other place but only in Slovenia um, we had some problems we were banned from <laughs> different countries because we we like to smoke marijuana and we had a little problems but we were all our concerts were full you will also get um, different pictures of us this is me behind the drums in one studio and this was our life when I was in high school and so you will also get different videos and um, and CD cover, lyrics and everything so from this from project 1 to 20 these are all my projects when I started to compose and to do soundtracks for um, different stuff so here you will find very different kinds of music from um, punky to rocky to electro to ambiental to very classic piano but these my first 10 years were very experimental very avant-garde I was just um, trying to do different stuff I was just learning different instruments guitars keyboards at the time I was um, buying a lot of gear a lot of uh, unusual instruments so I will just quickly show you from different projects what kind of projects they are so looking for an answer it was my first 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 recording um, I recorded on acoustic guitar and on my 4 track um, real tape recorder and the music is <laughs> you'll see fun but nice Okay, then I continued with Yellow Box. This here I started to program beats, program electronic drums, 
and I started to I bought one electric guitar and started to learn guitar so and I upgraded from my four um, real tape recorder I upgraded to digital recorder I bought some Roland something 808 something recorded four track recorded but it has a lot of effects inside and I enjoy it to record this stuff so sounds a little better right Okay, then I continue really with one little more um, punky electro guitar album. This is Red Room. Here I started to pre-program and do improvisation with with um, some program called Live Ableton. I recorded all projects live. Um, <laughs> This is the next album, White Room. It's a little similar. to learn to play trumpet but it's really 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 hard so I had to put a lot of effects to sound nice this is my next album it's called horse ride <laughs> with electronic piano I played in one take so this one hour it's a kind of a live concert in my studio and I continue to improvise that that, that way so this is the my live performance from one concert but here I played um, classic piano So get this whole project and this is rainy walk in 2001 yeah as you see 
half of my projects were based on 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 improvisation technique i here i started to improvise um, with electronics and acoustics and i tried to combine both so i I played one instrument was my laptop and the other was a keyboard or guitar or drums and I recorded those those setups um, into sessions and then later I just little edited it or and re, uh, record on and then master it so I was just learning to record to different techniques and you'll see in this whole discography there's a lot of experiments inside and also you must listen all these on headphones because i was recording all these on headphones so it's better to listen on headphones because you 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 feel the way i was i was playing at that time so this is my next cd is salvieri colasai This whole project was kind of an experiment because I I wanted to first to record drums, live drums for one hour and then um, upgrade with live piano playing and I tried to kind of uh, catch those um, playings together because I knew how I play drums and then with piano I tried to repeat drum playing with my fingers so um, it was the whole album was improvisation first drums then piano on the drums so and with singing so it was interesting concept that turned out quite good so next album here in 2002 and to 2004 I went into little avant-garde mode so I recorded really really weird stuff album was recorded live in one club so next next album is circle town circle town is even more experimental album i i got a lot of weird instruments in my studio a lot of synthesizers from 70s and 80s like cork ms20 and yamaha poly and Roland some stuff and i just put all instruments together and hit record button and then I just improvise and later i really mixed and this album came out <laughs>
Okay, next album. Here I went a little more poppy electronic. Pantex. Pantex is um, dark techno ambiental project. Smile 17. This was a very special project. Um, this project I made for one performance, and this project was based on the movie I also made. Um, and the concept of this uh, movie was that for 17 days I was recording um, my piano playing online but this online piano playing was was a little bit different because I played um, the piano to girls who was doing the sex cam chats you know those um, those things you know when men at evening go online and talk with uh, Todd talk dirty words with with those those Russian and different um, ladies and I thought at the moment that this is very bad 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 what is going on in our world because a lot of young kids were spending hours um, with them talking like stupid things you know and okay I will not go into detail with this but I thought it's those girls are very very they need somebody to to talk nice to them only f only for i don't know a few minutes so my project was that i that i for 17 days that i started to talk with them and i talked just nice thing and then i asked them if they want to listen to some music that i'm a musician and they all said yes yes i really want to hear your piano playing and then I play this piano to them like two or three minutes and I capture the screen recording so I capture all this what we are talking and all my music playing and their response and so I made a movie about this and this is the soundtrack of this movie <laughs>
Uh, it's a special project. So here we go to Orange Lover. Orange Lover is a very <laughs> crazy album. I did piano, electronic piano and guitars. I play guitars like and just producing noise out of it, scratching and pulling, pulling. this and was also made on different synthesizers psychedelic at the time I think I went to Peru to did some ceremony with shamans and when I come back I was very trans oriented I like psychedelic music and so in my experiments I use a lot of those techniques from trans and this is called I can fly, <laughs> fly into your eyes. I became a little mad in 2004. Good morning, America. Good morning, America. Good morning, America. Good morning. Okay, we must go faster, right? So inside, this is inside in, not inside out. Because inside out is here, here is inside in. And it's very um, David Lynch style soundtracks. And you can use you can use all these tunes, all these my tracks. You can use for the for commercial projects if you need to. Um, I give you all the license with this. So if you are making a lot of things, or commercials or videos or web stuff. You Okay, Electro Dramatic. Um, I played this album live and based on people went. Okay, and the last one, Dance with Miss Betty. I went with this project to Brazil to perform on some festival. <laughs> Okay. Hey.
this was my quick tour through discography one um, package as you can see you will get 20 projects inside almost one hour each one is long you also get this my um, first years with the band all what we did all pictures lyrics everything and all this music is commercial um, commercial license available or how do you say so you can use it in commercial projects as I said before so I hope you're gonna enjoy it um, um, listen to it with headphones for the more um, if you want to go more inside the sound and my uh, think of making music if you want to go more deep inside so I hope you're gonna like it and thanks for watching this and enjoy my music and talk to you soon have a nice day <laughs>